UEFA Euro or the European Championship is the most prestigious and most watched football competition in Europe which is held every four years. Its 17th edition will be played in 2024 in Germany but before that let's take a look at the all past winners of the UEFA Euro editions. The first ever European Championship was held in France in 1960 and since then, the competition has gained huge popularity. The current format will be used until 2032. France got the opportunity to host the first ever edition of UEFA Euro back in 1960. At that time, only four teams qualified for the finals including the hosts. So all four teams played the semi-finals straight and the competition hosted only four matches. At that time, a match for third place was also organized. Host nation France lost against Yugoslavia and the Czech Republic, Czechoslovakia at that time, lost against the Soviet Union, now Russia. The Soviet Union became the first ever winner of the European Championship but since then, neither the Soviet Union nor Russia won the competition. The UEFA National Team Tournament, known as the European Championship, has been held every four years since 1960. Its celebration has only been interrupted in 2020 due to the pandemic, but the suspended edition will be held this 2021 in June and July. So, we have good football waiting for us just around the corner. Along with the FIFA World Cup, the European Championship is one of the most prestigious tournaments in the world. As a novelty, this edition of the European Championship will be held in 11 different venues across the continent, with the final being played at London's Wembley Stadium. In this way, the UEFA wanted to commemorate the 60th anniversary of the competition. But let's cut to the chase. You've come here to tell you the history of the European Championship. Read on because we've got plenty of anecdotes, top scorers and all the winners of the European Championship waiting for you. The History of the Euro The first European Championship was held in France in 1960, but the concept of holding a European-level national football tournament dates back much further. The French Football Federation, led by Henri Delaunay, unveiled the concept in 1927, but it would take more than 30 years to become a reality. Delaunay, who would go on to become UEFA's first general secretary, was a big fan of the European tournament, which is why the trophy bears his name. The European Championship, or European Nations Cup, as it was originally called, was not very important in its first two editions in 1960 and 1964. It wasn't until 1968 that the tournament gained traction in Europe, thanks in part to the implementation of a group-based qualifying system, as was already in place for the World Cup. The modern era of European Championship history began in 1980, when Artemio Franchi, then president of UEFA, proposed increasing the number of teams in the finals to eight. The final stage was expanded to 16 teams divided into four groups in the 1996 edition. In addition, the famous golden goal rule, which states that the first team to score in extra time wins the match, was introduced in that edition's final. The 2000 European Championship was the first to be co-organized by two countries, Belgium and the Netherlands. This formula was used again in 2008, with Austria and Switzerland as hosts, and again in 2012, with Poland and Ukraine as hosts. The big difference in the 2021 edition, which will keep the name Euro 2020, will be that the venue will be shared between 11 cities across Europe, with the 24 participating teams competing for the trophy once again. The winners of the European Championship with three titles each, Spain and Germany are the two national teams that have won the European Championship the most times in its history. After winning the tournament for the first time in 1964, Spain is the only team to have won it twice in a row, in 2008 and 2012. Despite the fact that the German team has played more games, scored more goals, and won more games. National Team Titles Years Germany 3 1972, 1980, 1996. Spain 3 1964, 2008, 2012. France 2 1984, 2000. Russia 1 1960. 
Italy 1968. Czech Republic 1976. Portugal 1216. Netherlands 1988. Denmark 1992. Greece 1004. All time top scorers of the Euro Championship. This competition has featured some of Europe's best players, including Michel Platini, Cristiano Ronaldo, Antoine Griezmann, Ruud van Nistelrooy, Patrick Kluivert, Wayne Rooney, Thierry Henry, Zlatan Ibrahimovic, and Nuno Gomez, who were the top scorers in the Euro finals. The goals scored by each of them, as well as the first English scorer in the ranking, Alan Shearer, are shown in the table below. Puesto Jugador goals. 1 Michel Platini 9. Equals Cristiano Ronaldo 9. 3 Alan Shearer 7. 4 Antoine Griezmann 6. Equals Ruud van Nistelrooy 6. Equals Patrick Clivert 6. Equals Wayne Rooney 6. Equals Thierry Henry 6. Equals Zlatan Ibrahimovic 6. Equals Nuno Gomez 6. 11 Savo Milosevic 5. Equals Marco van Basten 5. 13 Milan Barros 5. Equals Jurgen Klinsmann 5. Equals Fernando Torres 5. Equals Mario Gomez 5. Equals Zine Dinesidane 5. Anecdotes of the Euros. In 1960, Franco refused to allow the Spanish national team to compete in the quarterfinals against the Soviet Union. After the match was tied, Italy won the semi-finals by a draw in 1968. Czechoslovakia won the European Championship in 1976 as a result of Panenx's famous penalty kick. In 1984, France became the only team to win every match in a tournament. Denmark won the title in 1992 despite winning only two of five matches. In 1996, Oliver Bierhoff scored the first golden goal to win the European Championship. In 2008, the European Championship trophy was redesigned and made larger and heavier. The final between Portugal and France in 2016 drew 600 million viewers. The host country of the European Championship has only won the tournament three times. Spain's Fernando Torres is the only player to have scored in both European Championship finals. One of the most prestigious and anticipated events in soccer is the UEFA European Championship, commonly known as the Euros. As we gear up for Euro 2024, let's delve into the history of this illustrious tournament, highlight past winners, and look forward to what promises to be an exhilarating competition. The UEFA European Championship was conceived in the late 1950s, inspired by the success of the FIFA World Cup and the desire for a similar continental competition in Europe. The first tournament was held in 1960 in France, originally named the European Nations Cup. It has since evolved in format and prestige, becoming a premier showcase of European soccer talent. The inaugural 1960 tournament featured only four teams, the Soviet Union, Yugoslavia, Czechoslovakia, and France. The Soviet Union emerged as the first champions, defeating Yugoslavia 2-1 in the final. The tournament's format has changed over the years, expanding to accommodate more teams and a more comprehensive qualification process. From its humble beginnings, the Euros have grown significantly. The tournament expanded to eight teams in 1980, then to 16 teams in 1996, and finally to 24 teams in 2016, reflecting the increasing competitiveness and popularity of soccer across Europe. Several countries have left their mark on the Euros with memorable performances and multiple victories. Germany, with three titles, 1972, 1980, 1996, Germany is one of the most successful teams in the history of the tournament. Spain, Spain has also won three times, 1964, 2008, 2012, including a remarkable period of dominance with back-to-back -back titles in 2008 and 2012. France, France has two titles to its name, 1984, 2000, both achieved with teams renowned for their flair and talent. The Euros have provided countless memorable moments, 
from Michel Platini's nine goals in the 1984 tournament to Greece's stunning underdog victory in 2004. These moments have cemented the tournament's reputation as a stage for both established stars and emerging talents. Euro 2024 will be hosted by Germany, marking the first time the country has hosted the tournament since reunification, West Germany hosted in 1988. Matches will be played across 10 cities, including Berlin, Munich and Hamburg, showcasing Germany's world-class stadiums and vibrant soccer culture. The qualification process for Euro 2024 is intense and competitive, with 53 UEFA member nations vying for a spot in the tournament. The top teams from the qualification rounds, along with the host nation Germany, will compete in the final tournament. As of now, the confirmed teams include Germany, host France Italy Spain England Belgium Portugal Netherlands Croatia Denmark Sweden Poland These teams represent the cream of European soccer, promising high-quality matches and intense competition. The 24 teams will be divided into six groups of four. The top two teams from each group, along with the four best third-placed teams, will advance to the knockout stage. This format ensures that the group stage is fiercely competitive, with every match having significant implications. The group stage matches will take place from June 14 to June 26, 2024. Each group will play in various host cities, ensuring that fans across Germany get a taste of the action. The knockout stage begins with the round of 16 on June 29 and runs through to the final on July 14, 2024. Each knockout match is a high-stakes encounter, where a single moment can change the fate of a team. Key Dates Opening Match, June 14, 2024 Group Stage, June 14-26, 2024 Round of 16, June 29 to July 2, 2024. Quarterfinals, July 5 to 6, 2024. Semifinals, July 9 to 10, 2024. Final, July 14, 2024. Euro 2024 will feature some of the best players in the world, and it's always exciting to see who will rise to the occasion. Keep an eye on established stars like Cristiano Ronaldo, Portugal, Kylian Mbappe, France, Kevin De Bruyne, Belgium, and Harry Kane, England, as well as emerging talents who may become the tournament's breakout stars. We see international tournaments like the Euros as an incredible opportunity for our players to learn and be inspired. Watching top-level soccer helps young athletes understand the game's intricacies, from tactical strategies to individual skills. We encourage our players to watch the matches, analyze the plays, and bring that inspiration back to their training sessions. Euro 2024 promises to be a spectacular showcase of soccer, bringing together the best teams and players in Europe. As we count down the days to the opening match, the excitement and anticipation are palpable. Whether you're a seasoned soccer fan or a newcomer to the sport, the Euros offer something for everyone. Who won the most European Championship titles? Germany and Spain are the most successful teams in the European Championship with three titles each. Which team has played the most editions of the UEFA Euros? Germany is the most appeared team in the UEFA Euro with 13 appearances out of 17 played so far. Who has hosted the most Euro editions? France and Italy have hosted the most Euro Championships three editions each. Which countries never qualified for the UEFA Euro? Armenia, Azerbaijan, Belarus, Bosnia and Herzegovina, Cyprus, Estonia, Faroe Islands, Georgia, Gibraltar, Kazakhstan, Kosovo, Israel, Liechtenstein, Lithuania, Luxembourg, Malta, Moldova, Montenegro and San Marino. How many teams have won the European Championship title? So far, 11 teams have won the European Championship since its inauguration in 1958. Which teams have won the UEFA Euro title? Winners, 
Germany, Spain, France, Italy, Russia, Netherlands, Czech Republic, Denmark, Portugal, Slovakia, and Greece. Which team has played the most matches in Euros? Germany have played a total of 53 matches in the UEFA Euro, more than any other team. Thank you for watching this video.